I knew to record this. We've been on the phone for 10 minutes. I'm sorry, this is gonna be an angry video. We're trying to cancel, I'm documenting this bullshit. And somehow, even though I'm registered, I have my own account, I have the app downloaded, I've talked to their tech support multiple times, they can't look up my account by my phone number, by my wife's, by my name, by her name, now just the address. No record of us. Give me one sec, I'm sorry. Okay. If you're gonna buy out, little tip here, I'm not a, you know, C-suite executive, but hey, why don't you try to put in infrastructure leading up to a buyout merger, than just ripping the rug out from under customers of a company you bought? Maybe that been real swell. At least we have the soothingness of this soundtrack. It had already been about eight minutes when I was like, I should probably record this. This is probably gonna go horribly as well. <laughs> We're about to hit 14 and a half minutes trying to verify my account. We're getting transferred. Hi, thank you so much for calling Grace Line, your local leader in internet service voice. My name is Liza, how can I help you? Hey Liza, we're trying to uh, find my account, I think. I was on the phone with someone else and my phone number didn't work, my wife's didn't, my name didn't, her name didn't, and then the physical address wouldn't pull up anything for the last person on the phone. But what I'm trying to do is just cancel service. Cancel the service. Alright, no worries. I'll go ahead and try to check here. Can I please have first the phone number or a phone number if you have it with you? You want to try to? Please you, have it? Yeah, sure. And may I please have your name? And how about the service address? Which strange is like I have the app, I'm logged in, I verified, uh, you know, phone number through that and everything. So I'm surprised that she can't find anything. I've already been on the phone with like different departments of um, Breeze Line, and they've been they haven't had this problem. That's weird. Yeah. Uh, actually, I was able to pull it up here, but I'll look. I'll just be needing to fully confirm or verify your account. So I'll just be needing to get the uh, the email address. All right. Thank you so much. You mentioned that you would like to cancel the service, right? Yes. May I please have the reason? Are you having an issue with a service or you already have a service? A new, a new provider. So now that they've caught up, I think we're just going back to Spectrum. I understand that. Especially you might use it um, for work or you're using it on um, a daily basis. But don't worry. I understand. I'll go ahead and explain this to the right department. And we were, uh, we were able to pull up your account, so no need to uh, worry. I'll just be needing to provide um, or connect you over to the right team, okay? Oh, okay. I'm going to get transferred again to uh, someone else? Um, yes, they are the one who could cancel the account. But don't worry, we already have it pulled off. So just bear with me. It might take only a minute. Candy, hold on. Okay. Thank you so much. One moment. Please line. I'm going to show the people. <laughs> I'll probably cut all this out anyway. Just trying to cancel service. Okay, and may I ask the reason why you're canceling today? Uh, well, you're okay, did you um, try to at least get a technician out there? Nah, not worth it. Nope. So we're just gonna switch to Spectrum. We'll see. We'll see what time shows. Do you still want me to proceed with your cancellation? Yes, please. Do you want me to cancel them as of today? Yes, please. Okay, there is a balance of $61.94. A partial yes. for the month? Okay, okay. Oh, yeah. If we can just pay that now, that'd be great. Okay, I can transfer you to the automated system. We don't take payments over the, you know, over the phone. One moment. This is the Breeze Line. The number you're calling from doesn't match to an account. Please enter the phone. I'll cancel it online.